Welcome to the nice sweet spot where the reviews are on target and tell it like it is, whether it hits the spot or misses the target. Speaking of targets, please click that subscribe button. So, if you're into fitness or you want to get into fitness, then you may know that in November you don't just celebrate Thanksgiving, but Planksgiving. <laughs> this is when you do a plank each day of November and maybe have a rest day or two in between. And with each plank that you do, the duration gets longer and longer, eventually reaching two or maybe a three minute long plank. Planks can be no joke, but believe it or not, they can be fun. Before you say whatever and leave my channel, let me tell you about today's review. It's on the Stealth Core Trainer by Stealth Fitness. It claims to level up your core training with games, but no playing around. Let's get down to this review. So what's sweet? Of course, being able to play games while working out and strengthening your core, that's essential. And the base is set up for a 360 degree motion. So you're not just getting bored doing the standard plank. Since it's multi-directional and it's moving at all different angles, you'll definitely feel it in your core and in your back too. With the games, it makes doing a plank or an elbow plank more engaging. Not just with your ab muscles, but your brain too, as you try to move quickly and precisely to increase your score with the games. Something else sweet is how you play the games. It comes with an app, of course. Just about everything seems to come with an accompanying app these days, right? The Stealth Fitness app is free. <laughs> and it includes four games. It's Stealth Speed Gliding, Color Chase, Galaxy Adventure, and Space Escape. Just in case you're saying to yourself, just four games, hold that thought. I'm gonna follow up when we get to the tart stuff. In discussing the four free games, they're fun enough to want to do more than once, I think so. And I especially enjoy Color Chase and Galaxy Adventure. Want to hold yourself accountable while seeing how you're improving? The app tracks your daily progress and it includes a real-time leaderboard. Not just nationally, but worldwide, which is kind of cool. Like many apps, you can set a daily reminder notification if the day just gets away from you, which happens to me sometimes. There's also a feature to do an endurance or countdown mode, depending on how you're feeling when you're about to do your stealth training. And you can create and compete in challenges with your friends and family or people you don't even know. And there's no subscription required, which I really like. Let's get down to the features that may leave a sour taste in your mouth. The main one is the price variation of the Stealth. I purchased mine for $129 through Amazon, but it can go up to $299. And the color, I'm not sure if that has anything to do with it, but it definitely played a role in me selecting which one I was going to buy. I was more willing to pay for the $129 than the $299. And I think with the price, with the upgrade of the app, that might leave you a little sour. And it's kind of borderline tart for me. And what makes it sour is that instead of there being a one-time fee, it's an annual $30 fee for the upgrade on the app. And, you know, this might depend if they're running a special or something like that. So you might see that the fee is increased or you might get a better deal and lock that in. Now, while I know that the company's in the business of making money, I just wish there was a lifetime payment option like many apps do these days and that you can still get all of the features. And that's why it leaves me a little sour, especially if you know if you purchased a $300 stuff, I can definitely understand that. Now, what's going to give you that tart taste? Make you go either way, depending on your mood. Let's get into that. I got a few on the list. Continuing with the fees, 
if you want to add family members or friends and you're just using one stealth, there's a fee of $10 on top of the annual fee. And though this might leave some people sour, I think it's more along the lines of tarts since it's not an additional $30 fee annually. And if you have limited space, you may find storing the stealth to be a hassle, but it can slide in the corner easily. Uh, you can even put it under the bed easily. Uh, mine I keep in the corner. It's still visible as a reminder for me to use it. And I got used to having it in the living room, but it kind of clashed with the decor. So it fits nicely in my basement with my other exercise equipment. Something else that may leave you tart is the hassle of logging in and out of the app if you're sharing the app with a family member or a friend who's using the same device as you. If you're both using different devices, then it's no longer an issue. As I mentioned earlier, the price varies depending on the color choices. Mine is yellow and it comes in orange for $179 and then green for $299, that's $299. And my phone can fit in nicely with this stealth, but unfortunately a tablet, it can't fit in there with a tablet. Most people have cell phones these days, so this will probably be a non-issue for you. Though I'm not sure why a person would do this, you can easily cheat <laughs> with this app and use it outside of the stealth to try and bump your numbers up on the leaderboard, but in doing that, you're only cheating yourself, right? Another tart feature is that some games are trickier than others, which might lead to frustration, but part of using a stealth and playing the games is to challenge yourself. So there it is, the stealth game, your core. Here's a wrap review just for you. Looking for something that'll tighten that core? Hey, yo, I got a tool that'll do that for sure. Comes in a few colors. It's called the Stealth. Struggle with planks? This'll give you some help. It's got an app with a few games for those of any age trying to chase those games. In no time, you watch your stats soar, challenging folks around the world on the leaderboard. Tilting that body side to side. A 360 motion, feel the glide. And that core in days getting stronger. Start off in seconds, your plank's getting longer. Fill it in your core and in your back. Notice those tight abs, don't know how to act. Endurance or the countdown to stop. In stealth mode at the nice sweet spot. I hope my review was helpful, especially if you're trying to determine if this is a wise purchase for you. If you have a question, drop it in the comments below and I'll try my best to answer it based on my personal knowledge and all the experience that I had in using the stealth. That's it for now. I'll see you next time at the nice sweet spot 